What's going on, everybody? It's the Murphy Bear Truck. But yeah, this is going to be uh, my new home. I'm going to be actually fixing this up. Um, I'm just going to do a walk around of the outside of it. I know starting off, I might have to pressure wash it. Uh, get the outside, you know, clean because, I mean, it's got the, you know, age on it. Uh, got a bunch of this ivory stuff. Could use some paint, you know, paint the trim up. But, I mean, it's got a nice size backyard. Just got to cut it all down, get the sticks up. And the property goes all the way back. There's a concrete wall back there. Got a window unit. Got an antenna, you know, for free, free local channels. Now I'm gonna be tearing this down right here. I decide I don't want that. So I want to build like a, a deck because the living room is actually right here. And then there's a hallway. So I want to put like a sliding glass door here coming out. And basically just tear that down and just make a nice deck right here. Uh, yeah, central air unit right here. I think it works. Not for sure. Um, but yeah, have to look into that. There's no dryer washer here so you have to wash your clothes and then hang them do it old style like you know just wash but yeah yeah I can't get up in there I think it's locked from the inside but like I said, all this right here is going to be torn down. It's it's pretty bad. It's not worth saying it, saving here. So yeah, I got to rip it all down. Which the school bus. We're going to be moving that out of the way. Because I'm going to be put, putting my semi truck right here. But yeah, it's just basically a back porch. It goes to the back door and, you know, it's... Not in good shape. So. But. You know. And the bathroom is actually right here. That's. So this right here. Is the bathroom. Area. Which I'm, I'm going to be showing you guys. Uh, so basically from the corner. Of the porch there. To there. The corner of the trailer. That's the bathroom. And there's a bedroom right there beside it. So my goal is to. Just take the um, bathroom and we're going to extend the bathroom over to this bedroom. So that way the bathroom is a little bit more bigger because there's actually three bedrooms here. So we got one, two, and then one at the front. So if we make the bathroom bigger, the bathroom be very back here. But, you know, this is a before video of me um, starting to work on it. So, first thing I might do is try to get a pressure washer. And we might just go ahead and clean up the outside first. And at least go ahead and get the outside looking a little bit more better. But, yeah. So, this is basically the before video um, of the property. Before I start working on it. But yeah, I'll be showing um, more videos of the inside here. Hi guys. This is the before video. My friend's at 5%, so hopefully I can get pretty good footage here for you guys. Uh, before my phone actually decides it wants to die on us. But this is the living room um, slash kitchen dining room so the dining table will go there and then 
You have a kitchen over there, but that's a bedroom over there. So let's just go to the left back here and uh, I'll show you guys, you know, what it looks like back this way. Sorry for the lighting. And this does have a heat pump. It's an electric heat pump. It used to be kerosene um, heated here. But we have the middle bedroom. So this would be bedroom number two. Got a lot of cleaning up to do in here. Um, and the floor is pretty soft. But, uh, but yeah, so we got a lot of stuff. We're going to have to go through here. Um, and it does have, have a washing machine. I didn't think it had a washer or dryer, but um, there is a spot you can hook a washer to. But as you can tell, it's not a lot of room here for a dryer. Um, but you can see how close the door is to that. We've got the panel breaker box. And then right here. But yeah, so this right here is the bathroom. Um, like I said, I, when I was going to walk around outside, it is a small bathroom, which my goals is in the series here of this remodel. We want to knock this wall out in our remodel series here. Um, cause there's a bedroom right here, right on the other side of the bathroom. So I figure if I can knock out that wall, we can actually extend the bathroom over. So this whole area right here is the bathroom and we'll, this little piece right here, we can add a wall going straight across here and it'd be like a little storage area right here. So it, we can eliminate this closet right here and make that middle bedroom bigger. Cause honestly, all I need is two bedrooms. Um, don't need three bedrooms, but I really don't like the idea of the small bathroom like it's really small just enough room just to turn around and i want a nice size bathtub that goes in the corner so i would like to put the bathtub over in that corner that has the jets um where you can you know relax but that's bedroom number one bedroom number two right there and then this is the back porch i was talking about um, it's pretty dirty out there. I mean, we got spotted webs and everything on the back porch. Pretty, pretty rotten. Can't really get out there. But yeah, so got a lot of um, stuff out there on that back porch. Got to clean up. But let me let me show you guys the the master bedroom, the the big bedroom of the house, which it don't have a bathroom or nothing. It's just just a uh, big big bedroom. So this right here is where my main room will be, where I'll be staying at the majority of my time here, right next to the kitchen. So convenient, right? You know, get thirsty, just walk right out at your bedroom door, and there's a refrigerator right there. So. But yeah, um, I don't like the little cubby section in the room here, like in between the closet and the wall. I would love to knock the closet out to just give you more room in your bedroom. Um, I can use the second bedroom as my closet, honestly. Just make this the bedroom where you sleep. Second bedroom can be your closet slash office. But we still have a lot of cleaning up to do here um, before we actually start our remodel series. But, but yeah, guys. So this is what it looks like so far. I mean, it's a nice little size kitchen area. And the refrigerator it hasn't been power on here. So we got some mold and food in there well, you know clean it out get it all cleaned out but yeah some of that wood's done warped right there yeah 
I'm not for sure if I'm gonna redesign everything. I might leave the kitchen the way it's set up for now. Um, because I mean it's all work in order. So don't want to change too much right now with it being a work in order state, but but yeah guys, that's uh what we have so far. We got two layers of plywood on the floor. We got one down and one on top of the other. So I think it's to make it more sturdier. Um because these single wire trailers to the floor do get a little soft on here. I really do like the background right there. That's right there is where I'll probably put my couch at right there in that little cubby section. But anyway, guys. I just wanted to share a before video. It is going to probably be a couple weeks before this comes out. Um, today's day is April the 29th, 2022. But I just wanted to show you guys a before video of my YouTube series of a remodel on my first single wire trailer. So just stay tuned. Um, also, I've got to show you in the walk, walk around video of the, of the deck. You know the front porch here me and my dad actually built this a couple years ago i think 12 13 years ago we actually built this deck so and it's still standing just need to pressure wash it. it's dirty pressure wash it and pressure wash the trailer and we'll we'll uh get some paint fresh paint i might get some blue paint paint it blue because i know a lot of these older trailers had a lot of blue on them Back in the day, but I know the paint right now is brown, but I might switch it over to the blue or do my favorite color, orange, and just put a big zero one on the side of it. How about that? But, uh, but yeah, so y'all just stay tuned and, um, I'll keep y'all updated. Hi, right, guys. Thank y'all for watching. Bye bye.